Thank you, Jennifer. Well, it's time for some man talk now. I feel like Tim Allen, tool time, time for some man talk. Something powerful, though, when men of God come together and commit themselves to living for Christ. Of course, we think it's important for couples to do this as well. Church small groups are great. Relationships in general are important when it comes to standing firm in Christ's promises. Also something special about women gathering together to encourage one another. We see lots of women's conferences. Same goes for men. Coming up later this month, Lima Baptist Temple is hosting a man-to-man -man prime rib dinner featuring well-known author and speaker Dennis Swanberg. Pastor L. Al Elmore from Lima Baptist Temple joins us now to talk about the event. Thanks for joining us. Thank you. How excited are you for this prime rib dinner, <laughs> men getting together, we're giving away a gun, Buckeye tickets, this is going to be great. Well, you know, men just eating, that's good enough, you <laughs> that's know, right. prime rib. But about a year ago, we did our first one and uh, went really well. Had about 125 men just starting up the men's group. This year, we look to have at least a couple hundred. Okay. So, very excited. Man Code is the book that Dennis Swanberg wrote. You guys are going through right. uh, a weekly Bible study that people can still be right. a part of leading up to right. the event. Just tell us about that book and, and what okay. Dennis brings. Uh, Man Code, if you were to take a combination lock and look at it, there's a combination. There's a code. That's what we want. And if people come to understand, especially men, what the Man Code really is, they can really become a catalyst for reaching other men for Christ. Yeah. So basically what you have here in this code is it starts off with one. We have to have the relationship with the one, okay. which is most important. Sure. That's the Lord Jesus Christ. And as that goes, you'll see that the next number is three. We need three good, loving, trustworthy men mm -hmm. in our lives. You know, women don't have that problem getting a bunch of friends, but men, it's hard for them to kind of open up and talk. Sure. But the three, the three are very important. These are people who, when you, if you die, you don't go around and say, well, let me tell you something I knew. But I couldn't tell you this until he died. No, I'm talking about that will keep it to themselves, keep their mouth shut. Right. Confidentiality. People who will ask you the hard questions. That's the three. And then you go into the 12. Everybody needs a pile of friends. Say a dozen friends, 12. And so these are people you may want to go to the football game with. You all want to get together and go camping, but a group of about 12. Mm -hmm. And then it goes to 120. 120, 120. In other words, that's kind of like a church. Okay. You used to call it a small group, but really it's a church. And a lot of your churches on average are, are like 100, 120. Sure. So it's very important to get involved in a church. But you see how it progresses. Mm -hmm. It starts with the 1, the 3, the 12, and the 120. And then the next number is 3,000. That's a community. And that's what we're trying to do is reach out to the community. So everybody needs a community that they can reach out to and impact. Folks that maybe never went to church or, you know, that community aspect, they hear Prime Rib. Yep. They hear men will be there. They hear some great prizes. We mentioned the 12-gauge shotgun, a yes. trigger grill, Ohio State football tickets. Yes. They might be a little hesitant. Oh, mm -hmm. you're talking about, you know, we got we to talk. I don't yeah. know if I like this. Why would they feel welcome right away, you think? Well, right away, number one is uh, we don't ask for anything. Everybody always wants to know, all right, what are you asking for? <laughs> what right. do you want? There's none of that. Yeah. Uh, Dennis Swanberg is not just an author and, and a great speaker. He is a Christian humorous. Okay. He is a comedian. Okay. And it's just fun guy to be around. It's just worth hearing him. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? Yeah. But uh, the gifts are good. We always want to be able to give gifts, you know, that's right. and that's kind of the hook that gets the people to come in and get a gift. But uh, it's just a great event. Men laughing, and that's what it's going to be about. He is the minister of encouragement. Yeah. And men today, we need encouragement. We, we can't get enough of it. Yeah. I love the slogan for man to man. Real men, real issues, real faith. Yep. Men can encounter God, and they yes. can do it together in this atmosphere, which doesn't happen a whole lot. That's right, and those, that is our theme. Real men, real issues, real faith, because that's what it is today. Mm -hmm. And you need other men. You know, I tell a lot of people, I don't have cancer. I'm sure you uh, know people who do. Sure. Could have been somebody in your own family. Right. But if I get cancer, I want to talk to someone who has had cancer and been there. It's the same thing with men. We deal with the same issues. Right. But if I, somebody's dealing with the same issue as me, I want to talk to that person. Yeah. So that's what we want. We want people to feel like they can get together and talk about these issues with real faith, with real men. Very exciting events coming Saturday, April 23rd, 5 p.m. There you see the details. You can call for tickets, $10 for the prime rib dinner, chance at all kinds of door prizes as well. If you get a table of six, it's $50, so a little bit of a benefit for that. So we want you to sign up soon so they can account for that, have enough prime rib That's to go right. around for everybody. There'll be plenty. <laughs> all right. Well, thanks for joining us. All right. Pastor Al Elmore. Thank uh, you. Mark Kuntz yeah. now has more.